Hello. Today I will show you how on the Huawei P40 Lite 5G you can use the Play Store. Uh, we will do it with a virtual machine. So uh, the method is very simple and safe. We tested on the we tested it on the Huawei P40 Pro for a long time and everything is fine. So uh, let's get started. But before that, I would like to ask you a lot to let me in a comment if you use this method and if it's working for you. And it will be also great if you leave uh, if you leave us a subscription and of course the like under the video. It is a great motivation for us. So let's start it. Let's tap on the browser and tap on the search pool and enter the VMOs phrase click on the switcher to find it and we have to enter this website VMOs virtual machine operating system so let's go for it after that we have to select the VMOs pro download so click on this button click to download and as you can see right now it is downloading the file so we have to be just patient and wait until it be finished. Okay, and right now we have to tap on the switcher and click allow. Click install. And right now we can open it. We have to slide four times. And after that, click to enter VMOS Pro. Click to one click authorization. Tap to set up now. Just simply tap on the switcher, then we have to go back and accept all of the permissions that pop up on our screen. And we have to get this first Android 7 point wide so let's click to add on the right corner and right now there there's the installing process of the virtual machine okay and right now we have to go right here for the settings we have to tap on the switcher to enable Google services click confirm Tap on the complete and after that we have to scroll down and also select the background keep alive. Tap on the allow and after that click here on this floating on this floating bar and tap to shut down. And after that we have to open it one more time. And as you can see right now we can open the menu and here we can find the Play Store. So let's enter. And right now we have to sync in with our account. So there's the checking info. And let me just input our data. So at the first, we are going to input the email. And after that, we have to click on the next button. And we have to open the Play Store one more time. Click to sync in. So input your email again. When you do this, click next. And after that, we have to input our password, as you can see. So I'm going to input it also. And after that, we have to click on the next button and accept all of this in terms of the service stuff. I don't want to back up to the Google Drive, click accept. And as you can see right now, we are in the Play Store on our Huawei P40 Lite 5G. So um, we can try to get maybe Gmail application. And also we can go for the Google Documents. Maybe we can open Google Sheets. And we can also try to download the FIFA mobile. Uh, 
Uh, so there's the. It's probably this game, right? FIFA Campaign. Let's get it. So right now we can just go to the main screen, and here we are able to log into our Gmail account. And you can, as you can see, it's working. And also we can open Google Sheets. Here we got the FIFA Ultimate Team application. And as you can see, it is also working, but we have to log into this uh, application. And of course, we can just minimize this virtual machine and we can just simply go back to our Huawei smartphone. And if you want to just open it one more time, and for example, you can play the game, you can just do this right through the settings. So that's how it looks. I think that it is a pretty cool alternative to this famous um, app transfer method from the second smartphone. I know that it is not a perfect, but I think that a lot of you will benefit from that. So it's working, right? And uh, please remember to appreciate our time and to leave a comment, like, and, a subscri and, and to subscribe to our channel. And I think that's all. So see you guys in the next videos. Bye.